everyone. My name is Duncan White. I'm the editor of the International Fire and Safety Journal. I'm here at FDIC in Indianapolis, and I'm delighted to be talking to Stephen Roberts. Stephen, how are you, my friend? I'm well, I'm well thank you. Are you? It's, I, very well, and uh, enjoying the vibes and the uh, excitement that we're seeing here on the show floor today. It's, uh, it's not very often that I feel intimidated, but uh, I'm glad that we're not playing rugby today. Stephen. Such a great brand with IDEX and that umbrella organization of the, of the long-standing brands within the IDEX group. Yeah. Tell us a little bit more about those. Yeah, sure. So IDEX is an umbrella brand for over 10 companies now, uh, some of which have been in business uh, for over 100 years. Uh, so you'll recognize brands such as Lucas, Hearst Jaws of Life, Akron Brass, Godiva, Hail Pumps. Uh, and the idea here is to bring multiple brands together and product categories together to create solutions uh, and really kind of make things more effect efficient, safer uh, and qu quicker for the firefighter on the ground. And uh, firefighter safety, and uh, you don't need to go too far away from IDEX to see the products and the, uh, the way in which uh, firefighter safety is paramount to, to the company. And uh, it was great news for, for the industry to hear when uh, my great friend and a friend of the industry, Ian Dunbar, has uh, joined the, uh, the IDEX family and uh, you, must be, you must be delighted to have him on board. I'm incredibly delighted. He's, Ian is a great guy and uh, his role is key to our business and driving our business forward. He's uh, going to be helping us get closer to the uh, customers, closer to the users and um, really kind of understand the firefighter more so we can be safer, more efficient and quicker. Yeah, and the passion that Ian brings with everything that he does and uh, his research and his, his quality is, uh, uh, goes beyond words. But, so we're going to spend some time this afternoon. We're going to go around and look at different brands and you'll uh, be hearing from different brand managers. But Stephen, really appreciate Good your time. You. Thank you. Thank you. Hello everyone, Duncan White here again, but you know that. I'm here now with Dylan Bucci at uh, IDEX and we're talking about Sam Boost. This is a great product that's really starting to take the industry by storm. Dylan, tell us more. Yeah, so Sam Boost is really affecting change on the fire ground, especially um, for your firefighter maker making entry and your pump operator, right? So we are providing a lot of efficiency and making that pump operator a lot more versatile. And we are giving unprecedented control and knowledge to that firefighter, right? So with Sam Boost, we're really affecting fire ground operations in that, in that initial attack, right? So from a, an engineer's perspective, we're streamlining some of those operations to help, make that, help get them to that secondary water source faster to help that firefighter inside. And then with that firefighter inside, we're providing them um, a level of confidence and knowledge about what they can do to help uh, in that attack to make them a better firefighter and to make them a safer firefighter, right? Which is better for that firefighter, that department in that community, right? And it also benefits life safety. That's the, right. The more efficient the firefighter operation is, the, uh, the quicker they get in and do what they need to do in uh, rescuing and saving life. 100%. Yep, that, that's what this is really built around, right? It's a built that's, uh, around that safety portion, right? An enhanced firefighter is a safer firefighter, right? And then that perpetuates out into that community, helping save victims and property. It's, uh, we've heard it here first, and uh, as we know with IDEX, they're always pushing the boundaries with technology and innovation, and life safety is paramount. Firefighter safety ensures that life safety is enhanced. So, as always, we are so grateful for the work that the IDEX group do for the firefighting community doing a great job here on the IDEX stand today. We've moved from Sam Boost and we're now just looking at Sam. So Dylan, tell us how this works with Boost and how that interacts with the firefighter safety. Right, so Sam, it's a massive advancement in technology in firefighter safety and fire ground safety. It's a very intuitive display. It helps make firefighters jobs easier and in turn, like we talked about, a job that's easier for a firefighter, more efficient, is more safe for that firefighter and more safe for that community, right? Um, so um, the intake to the priming to the discharges, SAM affects change in all of that, right? It makes that process much more intuitive. A process that's easier, that's more efficient, helps save those lives, and it helps save that property, right? And, and just as everything here with IDEX, right, we're trying to affect change to make rescue operations easier, and SAM is the leading technology in that space to do that. And like we said, this technology, in the old days, the firefighter had so many different things to, to balance and uh, ensure that the intake was sufficient for the uh, 
for the flow and we're now giving the firefighter additional tools, enhancing technology to say it's got your back. 100% right. Yeah, traditional, traditional pump operation methods, you'll see all those handles, all those wheels, right? They're pushing, pulling. It takes a lot of experience and it takes a long time to get really, really good at that, right? And there are firefighters that are really good at that. That It is their second nature to know exactly how to do it and what to do. And, and what we've done here is we've tried to help put everyone in that position, right? Um, so like I said, that guy with six months of experience, we're trying to get him closer to that 20 year guy that has that second nature, right? Which if we're able to do that, we're able to close that gap, we're able to make that firefighter safer. And that's really what we're trying to do. And how good is it that we've got companies like IDEX that are having the backs of firefighters and providing us with uh, new technology to make life safer? We're gonna continue around the, the IDEX booth to, to learn a little bit more. We're still here on the IDEX booth and I'm delighted to be joined by Chris Johansson. Chris, tell us a little bit about your role within IDEX and uh, in relation to tactical response. Yes, sir. So I'm the regional sales manager on the fire side for the Southwest and then I also manage the Hearst tactical line for the entire United States. Excellent. So we couldn't get anybody better to tell us about the, uh, the new product. So let's go. Yep. So this is our new mini cutter. It's the S120. Very sleek, lightweight design, ergonomic, uses the star grip just like we do on the rest of our tools. Turn on the power, operate the star grip. It's a guillotine cutter, operates at about 40,000 pounds of foot force uh, in, the, in the cutting force of it. We run an 18 volt Makita battery with this. Uh, when you purchase the tool, it comes with two batteries, a charger and the tool itself. And then you can open and close. So it can get in those confined spaces for cutting pedals, seat belts, headrests, and then when you transition even into things that don't have motor vehicle accidents, think of locks on doors, chains on gates, it can help out with storage units. Uh, when you go into law enforcement, it translates over there, active shooters responding to that, cutting locks, your general crimes investigators doing search warrants on storage units again, just anything that needs to be cut, it can do it. Um, it'll cut grade 43 chain. We've cut up to a level 12 security lock with master lock. They rate those one to 15. We've done up to 12. On that, it'll cut half inch rebar, doesn't even realize it's there. So, and we've even doubled up with the chain and the locks and it still cuts both of them at the same time, no problem. It does exactly what it says on the tin and I think that uh, that partnership with Makita is, uh, is just perfect. Two really trusted brands working together to give firefighters the best ability to make that early attack. And like, uh, like Chris said, it's not just firefighters, that whole area that you can go in through law enforcement and any agency that needs to make uh, early interaction. So let's talk about the big boy. Yep, so what we did is the Hearst has been trusted for over 50 years in the fire service. So we took that trust and that technology and converted it into the tactical world. So what we did is we took our combi tool and we, we made some changes. So it's black, of course, everything's muted out. The lights don't light up like they do on the fire side. And then we anodized all what would be aluminum so it's not reflective. And then we actually added, these are the spreader tips. We have a set of door tips. So now you can take that force and technology that we're using on cars and go into doors. So you can breach doors. This will carry you up through medium light armor to where we have a, a larger one to this that will take you up to medium heavy armor. So even if it's a law enforcement tactical world or all the way up through the military and some of the things that they do in their missions, you have the ability to use the technology. It's waterproof, submersible, can be used down to 20 feet. Batteries are salt water rated. Everything can be used in any environment. Well, any environment. And uh, it goes without saying that the, the trust and confidence that comes with that Hearst brand is, uh, is really important. Chris, it's been a pleasure, my yes, friend. Sir. Take Thank care. You. We're still on the IDEX booth and uh, we're seeing so many fantastic products today. And uh, this is by far one of the most exciting things I've seen at the show so far today. Paul, great to see you. Pleased to meet so, you. To meet you Paul Jameson from LifeSafe is going to tell us a little bit more about the product and how it is uh, revolutionising the ability to extinguish those hard to, hard to get out fires. Yeah, great. Thanks, Duncan. Uh, my name is Paul Jameson from LifeSafe Technologies and I'm the Chief Commercial Officer. I'm really excited to be here with IDEX, our new partners of our global distribution partners, actually, which have signed very recently. The products here at LifeSafe are revolutionary I think in terms of how they're developing and really changing that firefighting scene so starting with the all-in-one and the range of fluids that we have are in, absolutely incredible and I, 
really think are going to change the safety of firefighters, but also really just how people tackle a fire and uh, put it out. And exactly, and it's that ability to, to put it out first time and ensure that it is out because uh, all the, uh, the firefighters watching will know that there's nothing worse than having left a fire and then getting a recall to go back there and do it again. And if you can find a trusted partner like LifeSafe to uh, do it right first time every time, then uh, it's going to be there. So, we're hearing all the time now about these forever chemicals. Yep. What makes, what makes LifeSafe different from a lot of the other things that are out there on the market? Yeah, we, we pride ourselves in being non-toxic, non-hazardous, fluorine-free, and really that is our mantra. We don't put anything out in the market if it doesn't have those three things attached to that label. So we've been really, really clear in we, to fight a fire, you need to have the right product, the right structure within that product in terms of chemicals, but also it has to be safe. Yeah. If it's not safe, it doesn't come to market from us. Exactly, and uh, we've been talking about firefighter safety and life safety. This is a product that gives us all those, but also uh, doesn't do any damage to the environment. That uh, we've uh, we've done far too much damage to the environment over the years, and products like this will ensure that we start to uh, to repair the damage we've done. Paul, Thank it's a pleasure, much. my friend. Thank you. Take care. Well, that was a whistle stop tour of the IDEC stand here at FDIC, and uh, it's been great. What uh, what a pleasure to speak to so many passionate people in relation to fire and life safety. Steve, thank you for hosting us, my friend. It's, no, always, it's always a pleasure. It's a pleasure. And uh, we look forward to uh, doing this again and uh, when there's the next bit of technology and innovation. Absolutely. So I'm Duncan White. I'm the managing editor of the International Fire and Safety Journal. It's been my pleasure to be working alongside IDEX today at FDIC.